This is going to be an ASMR she win try on haul. So not a she in try on haul, but she win something different. So there's this company who reached out to me um, for a collaboration. They are a drop shipping wholesale OEM kind of store. And I'll insert some screenshots of their app and stuff like that. Um, this is not technically sponsored because they're not paying me, but they let me pick out five things for free to try on for you guys. And I will have any affiliate links or whatever they want to give me down below in the comments. Um, even though it is a wholesale website, I do believe that there is no minimum purchase, which is kind of cool. So wholesalers can use it and so can regular regular people who don't just want, who don't want to buy like 17 of the same thing. You know what I mean? Um, I will say that, um, I was browsing their website and I w went through like every little thing. It was pretty Mormony. Um, not stuff that I typically wear. You know that, um, I don't really dress like a Mormon. Uh, not at all. But I found a couple things that I thought might be kind of cute in way. Um, they do advertise it as Southern wear. So maybe Mormons, Southerners dress like Mormons. I, I don't, I don't know. But, um, came in this. And originally one of the five things that i picked and also like the thing i was most excited about was a um it was like a pullover sweatshirt waffle knit i believe and it had a skeleton hand that was going like this and it said hey loose and they're like you can't pick that one because it's on pre-order and i was like that's a bummer so i had to pick something else instead so i'm just gonna grab it randomly the little bags that they come in are nicer than the Shein bags. I'll give them that. It's like a, I don't know. It's just a nicer feeling plastic. I know that's not important, but it's just an observation. And this is a size small. And it says black, but I don't think it is black. It's gray. Ooh, that feels cool. So, smells strange smells strange but the strange smell will come out in the wash i am sure of it this is a fringe fringy duster cardigan and i hope that the sleeves are long enough on me i got it in a size small i kind of wish that the fringies went all around the neck but they do go all around the bottom and wasn't expecting the fringe to be this faux suede, like fuzzy material, but it is, which is kind of cool. And let's see. The fabric feels nice. The fabric doesn't feel bad. This is like thick and stretchy, nicer than she in fabric. So far. Oh, there's pockets. I didn't know there were pockets. There are pockets. Um, I'm going to put on a more regular shirt to try this on with so that we can get like the the full effect all right so this is what this looks like it's like a little twirl you know, like dumbledore in the back the sleeves are just barely long enough but they're probably a good length on most people because i have really long arms um, if I would have gone with a medium, the sleeves would probably be a little bit longer, but then they'd be baggier, which I wouldn't really like. I feel like this would be good for, like, covering up and cozying up in, like, an airport. I don't know why that's the first thing that came to my mind, but, like, yeah, like an airport travel comfort piece. And the pockets are, like, right there. Um, so, so yeah, and it's warm and it's hot in this house, so. Oh, 
Here's another gray thing. I promise I'm just randomly picking and not everything is gray. Oh, I forgot to do fabric noises, didn't I? Niceness. I want to go to the boardwalk. We don't have like a fun boardwalk like the ones in Jersey, like the ones up north down here, but we have like a pseudo touristy boardwalk kind of area. I want to go to it, but like my only friend isn't getting back to me, so I'll probably end up with nothing to do. But I'm hanging out with you right now, so that's something. At least I didn't put on the makeup, you know what I'm saying? Anyway, I'm not rambling about my abysmal social life. I got this in a medium because it's a hoodie and I wanted it to fit comfy. And looking at it, I'm glad I got it in a medium. It doesn't have any aglets. They just tie off like that. Um, this is the texture of the inside. So it's kind of lightweight for a hoodie, but I feel like that'll be good for Florida and the quality does not seem too bad off the bat. Let's try it on. Actually, I'm gonna pause this so I can take a picture for the thumbnail. You know, maybe I should have gotten a small because it is pretty oversized. It does cover everything. I think it's supposed to be oversized, so I probably should have gone with my regular size. But it's comfy. It has like a very casual, rainy day, boyfriend hoodie kind of feel. And this is the hood. So I can be all secretive and commit crime. I also feel kind of bad for saying how more money the website was. Um, I wanted to clarify. If you're into like modest clothing and very like mature kind of clothing. They had a lot of like flannels and jackets and cardigans and, and dresses that were flowy and not form-fitting. And some people are into that and that's cool. Um, You guys will see in some of the thumbnails that I post so you know, you know what their vibe is. There's the little snorker back there. You see the baby? You know it'd be cool to get like, go to a t-shirt shop and get something cool printed on here. Because I just smacked myself in the face of that. Because I like fun stuff. If I wish there was a skeleton hand on this that said hang loose. That would be pretty corny, but I would like it. So that's all that matters. Alright, two down three, two, and go. Oh. We'll see. These, they will say, these little things be popping off. Not that that matters. Unless you like reusing your eggs like I do. And we got this. This was the one that I asked for in lieu of the um, hang loose skeleton sweatshirt that I wanted. I was like, okay, what about this one? And they were like, I guess they were like, yeah, they just shipped stuff, so I assume. Okay, so this is like a beach cover-up, hippy-dippy, psychic kind of vibe thingy. What do you even call this? I don't know, but look at the fringes. The fringes are cool. They're knotted. There's some rhyme and reason there. That's pretty cool. This is one size fits all. I feel like a cool grandma that smokes a lot of grass. It's fun. My only um, gripe would be I wish that it was um, double sided because whenever this part flips around and flips around if you wear it like that it makes it look kind of cheap because you know because the fabric's not double-sided but other than that it's 
pretty cool. Makes me feel all cool and boho. Here's the next one. It's another beach cover up sort of thing. Because I wasn't about to buy it, but one of the girls was about to go Okay, so. I mean, not that I bought anything, I didn't buy anything, it's so was sad to me. Which I'm grateful for if you are a she one person and you're watching this, thank you. I love free stuff. This is also a one size fits most and it's shaped like a box until you put it on but this is what these fringes look like pretty 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 and it's got all of these bright floral patterns let's try it on i don't know if you can still hear some of them but there was just a not a swarm a flock of very very noisy little parrots that just flew through here living in florida is cool okay so here's this one it's very long kind of feels like a robe or a kimono um the fabric is kind of heavy and slinky and slippy so i do feel like it's gonna fall off of my back constantly but i do feel like it's kind of cool it's comfy. I think this would be good for a beach day in particular because it's so big. I feel like you could just lay it out, use this as your beach blanket to lay on, and then throw it on instead of carrying it back. And then you're all fancy. Alright, this last one is not a hoodie, a sweater, or a Okay, parrot, calm down. Or a beach cover-up. This is athletic wear. And I got it in a size small. And it's a two-piece set. And here are the pants. Maybe they're more like capris, I'm not sure. But they're this tie-dye kind of thing. And then here is the little top sports bra thing. Oh, the one they gave me has a lot of red on it. So that's a little bit of a bummer. But it's free and we're not going to look a gift horse in the mouth. Let's try it on. Hmm, I think this might be my favorite thing of the things. They are full length pants. I mean, they would be on most people. I have long ones. Um, they're a little bit above the ankle on me. But I think they're cute. You guys can let me know if you can see my underwear through them. That's a good test. Um, because I am wearing black underwear. I can't really tell, but maybe you can. I'll pro I mean, I'll be able to tell when I watch this back, but. I do wish that the top I got matched the bottom more. I wish it had more white gaps. The back does, the front. Mm, weird, weird cut of fabric. And I also don't like how it's not low enough to give me any cleave. But other than that, I think it's pretty cute. It feels like pretty decent quality. So yeah, that's cool. Um, that was all of the things in this haul. Thank you, Shewen, for partnering with me. And um, if any of y'all are interested in anything or just shopping their website in general, I will have links down below again, like I said. And my question of the day will be, <sighs> do any of y'all have hangover cures? Because I'm currently hangover. So if you do, what do you, what do, you do when you're hungover? you just maybe you don't drink in which case if you have any any cold remedies that really work for you i always like little life hacks and being hung, hung blah, blah, blah. and being hungover sucks 
but anyway thank you guys so so much for watching and i hope you have a wonderful wonderful day hey here's the current list of my wonderful wonderful amazing patron subscribers thank you guys again so much for all of your support